Everyone over here in this community would like to send greetings to you in Nova Scotia. It's just an ordinary day in Goosner, isn't it? Oh, yeah, yeah. So we've got, on? well, we're four weeks to go before the festival. and We've got here children from four to eleven, desperately trying to learn in a very short space of time how to dance around this maypole, and it's quite tricky. Do you think that you'll be ready for festival day? Yes. No problems. Oh, totally confident, yeah. If we could only fix the weather, mm. we'd have no worries. Um, I'm the man who's making sure it's safe. Right, that's so what we're doing out. this year. So we're leading out, uh, coordinating the road closures, make sure there's no cars coming down the festival route, uh, make sure nobody gets hurt. We're very well supported by Chris Banks, mm. our, our local policeman, uh, but he'll be looking after the real policing. <laughs> and we'll do the, the, the rest of it in conjunction with the Guild volunteers. So we've got some guild volunteers coming down to help us uh, nice to make sure they'll, you know, yeah. a spare pair of hands here and there, maybe their radios to help with our communication. Well, I'm Eileen Roberts. I came to live in Goosner in 1948 with my husband. And we came to the local shop in the village. And we were there till 1976. And uh, you were the shopkeeper. Thoroughly enjoyed our, yes, thoroughly enjoyed the time that we were there. So yes. you know everything. So we kn I, I've seen all the festivals since 1948. Um, because there's not just the planning of the festival, there's the fundraising that we do as well. So we've had Goosner's Got Talent uh, in January. Yeah. Um, we've got the festival coming up June. We've had a, a jumble sale as a, a fundraiser. Then we'll have Sports Day after that, which all connects into uh, what happens in the village. Mm -hmm. So it's although the, the festival's a highlight, uh, there are activities and events throughout the year that we, we all work towards planning anyhow. Alex, you were leaning against this maypole before keeping it down flat on the ground. Is that your job? Yes, it is. But you're just helping out because on festival day you'll be doing something different, is that right? Yeah, what we're organising the fans dressing the visiting queens. Right. I'm told that you're on the committee. Yes. What's your job on the committee? Whatever I'm given really, right. but oh. the youngest men be on the committee. How old are you? 14. So girls, what will you be doing in the Goosner and Whittingham Festival this time? Um, we're walking around Goosner Village. And did somebody say they're going to be flower girls? Yeah, me! Right. Have you got nice costumes ready? Yeah. Yeah, put your hand okay. on. Can you tell me what your costumes are like? What colours um, are they? Mine is white with pink and white flowers on. Um, and mine is pink with pink flowers on. Anybody mine, else? You're my little mine's friend, white. Mine. Mine's yeah. mine's white I've got a special on. friend there. So you know everything about village life, really, well, don't you? Well, I know the <laughs> So your children and grandchildren will have taken part in the festival? Yes, they have. So My daughter was, was a queen at one time, and she's coming up. My name is Phoebe. And my name is Chloe. I was the festival queen in 2011. I'm going to be the festival queen in 2012. Which means I'll be crowning Chloe on the 2nd of June in 2012. This is Ruby and she was my attendant in 2011. And this is Melissa, she will be my attendant in 2012. <laughs> <laughs> How much are you going to pay her? <laughs> will you be proud? Yeah, I will be definitely very proud. Right, so Certainly one of the things that uh, Chloe said was that uh, my, unfortunately my wife died in 2008 and she t turned around and promised my wife that uh, she'd be festival queen and she turned around and said I'm doing this for Jill and th that made me immensely proud. Does it really bring everybody together? Yes, the festival in particular, the people will come from all over the world quite mm. literally um, to come back home to, to come back home for the festival, yes. So it's, it's that important that uh, it's, it's people make a special effort for it, really. Uh, what will your function be this, this year? Will you be sitting, enjoying, or will you be taking part? Um, I'm taking part. What will you be doing? On the Mother's Union float. As usual. As usual. <laughs>
And when do our guests arrive from Nova Scotia? They're I think. arriving. No, really, but I've forgotten. The Thursday before, and we've got them a packed program on the Friday. They're going to Beebeck, that's Broughton Business and Enterprise College, and they're going to be planting an apple tree in the new community orchard. And after that, they're going to the mayor's parlour to take tea with the mayor. <laughs> then we're hoping to fit in all three primary schools. Um, after that, Mrs. Kirkham's cheese. <laughs> I think that's enough for one day. <laughs> Everyone over here in this community would like to send greetings to you in Nova Scotia. And we're very much looking forward to meeting four more of you uh, in a few weeks' time. Are you looking forward to Festival Day? Yeah. What will you be doing? I'm doing maple. Have you ever made pole dance by any chance? No, I haven't. It's one thing I would like to have done, but I, I wasn't the right age, if you know what I mean, at the time. So it was hello from Goosner to our new friends. So I'll count one, two, three, and then you'll all smile like mad. Are they good dancers? Uh, well, one, the, one little girl has only been one, one previous week, so she's trying to catch up, so she doesn't know which way she's going yet. This is special because we're doing a twin in the Annapolis Valley. In Nova, in Nova Scotia. That's it. And they have a festival called the, do you know what it is? Some they trees have... now. It's just yeah. coming out. Oh, apple blossom. <laughs> One, two, three. Hello from Gisler to our Right, that was good for a practice. Oh wait, come here. Stop being shy. Yeah. Who's this come on, with you here? Stop being shy. Who's this gentleman that's with you here? This tall, good-looking gentleman. Good looking. Good looking. Gentleman. Keep going. Is You're doing well. Is this the Queen's dad? <laughs> hey? How much are you going to pay her? through that rock. Oh, no. Come on, no. tell me. If I told you, it might not come through.